Morning everybody, Ryan G. So here, taking the next 30 seconds to show you this new Bluetooth controlled uh, Solos transformer, which uh, I was a little skeptical about until I actually saw the thing and uh, really like the simplicity of it. Um, I feel like a lot of these automated controls are complicated just for the sake of being complicated and this thing is very simple. So uh, this is what the actual unit looks like. Now uh, again, just looks like a normal transformer. Um, it's a 150 watt unit. It also comes in 300, uh, two commons, and 14 volt taps. So um, nothing super special about the unit itself. As I as I said, the the beauty of it is in the app, which uh, I'm gonna go over with you guys right now. So as I mentioned, what, what I really like about this unit is the simplicity of the application. So I can literally talk you through the whole setup process in two minutes here. So I just downloaded the app. I'm going to open it. I'm in landscape mode on my phone right now because if I go to portrait, it'll look really crappy on a video. So typically you'd be working with a bigger screen than this. But I went to connect. The unit is already there. It already recognizes the unit. So I click on it. I've got my GPS locator on on my phone, which 99% of us do. Um, so it already knows my location. I don't have to go set my location by putting in an area code or zip code. I don't have to worry about anyone's Wi-Fi passwords, which can be a pain in the ass. I don't have to worry about whether there's Wi-Fi signal or not. Um, so this is the dashboard. It, it's so simple and straightforward. Um, it automatically defaults to dust to dawn. So if somebody, it, like it's foolproof, you can't, you can't mess this thing up. You plug it into the wall and it's automatically set to dust to dawn. Um, in order to change it, we have a couple of options. It's got a demo mode. It's got dust to midnight already preset. So I can activate that. Sure. I want to activate that. Or I can add a new program. So it will allow me to do dust to a certain time. It will allow me to do a certain time on, a certain time off. The only downside that I'm seeing as of now is I can't figure out uh, if you can do multiple on-off times. It seems like there is only one on-off time. Uh, another cool thing about it is there's a power meter. So I don't have anything plugged in right now, but... Pretty cool that you can see uh, on your phone exactly how many watts are being consumed. So I was skeptical about Bluetooth from, from a range standpoint, but we tested this thing over 90 feet in our warehouse through a wall and we're able to, uh, to still turn it on and off. Uh, maybe that is an indicator of how crappily thin our walls are, or maybe it's just a good strong Bluetooth signal. Um, but either way, the signal range isn't going to be an issue from, from what I'm seeing. And that was my biggest concern. So yeah, obviously there's an upside to, to Bluetooth as, as well as a downside. Same thing with Wi-Fi, but simplicity seems to be the major upside here. And uh, I hope you guys check this thing out. Call with questions.